are watching Channel Y. Channel Y, a South Asian Canadian channel. My name is Andrea Delzato and I'm Director and Executive Vice President at Tridel. As many of you know, the well will reinvigorate this incredible 7.8 acre corridor between Wellington and Spadina with one of the most ambitious master plan communities in Canada. It will feature more than 1 million square feet of exclusive office space, half a million square feet of premium retail and food experiences, and 1,700 residential units. Um, I am uh, very pleased to be here and I just, when you get people of the caliber of uh, Andrew from Tridel, Ed, Ed and, and the, the team from Rio Can and Jake and others from Woodburn, but really those companies and what they represent and the great traditions that they represent uh, in our city, um, then you can't help but to have a project that's going to be very special. The well is a transformational project and one of the most complex, multifaceted developments Tridel has ever worked on. The 7.8-acre site that you see behind us will soon be home to the most vibrant social and lifestyle hubs in the city, spanning 3 million square feet above grade and another 1.5 million square feet below grade. Uh, it's, it's a thrill to be here and it's particularly gratifying for me because I had the pleasure of uh, you know, being at, at Rio Cam when we acquired the property uh, many years ago and I walked the site with Ed Sunshine, our CEO, uh, Steve Diamond from Diamond Corp, uh, who was a joint venture partner with us at the time, and of course Michael Emery from Allied Properties REIT. Uh, and and the, the four of us walked the site and saw there uh, what I'd have to say with all due respect to the Thompson family and the Globe and Mail, something that was very much unspectacular, uh, other than the Art Deco doors that marked the front entrance to the Globe and Mail building. Uh, there was nothing that really spoke to uh, the, the prominence of this site, this very uh, amazing site to be made more amazing by the advent of the Rail Deck Park, which we're a big fan of. Um, and, and so now to see the juxtaposition between what was there then and what is here now is truly remarkable to, to me. And that, you know, that the, uh, the, um, uh, the, the movement forward in this site uh, is, is due to so many people and so many efforts, but again, I think the key word is collaboration. As you've already heard, the well is a huge project. It is the largest mixed-use development underway in Canada, and it's a great story for the City of Toronto. It's the start of something new that's going to truly benefit everyone in the city. Uh, me and the team at Woodborn are thrilled to work with such experienced and thoughtful partners who all share our vision for a true live-work-play destination. Uh, first of all, if I can have your name and designation. So I'm Jim Ritchie from Tridel. I'm Executive Vice President. So when do people actually get to live, work and play here? Well, they get to do that uh, at the end of 2022 and the beginning of 2023. Uh, as you can see, we're, we're under construction, uh, but it's a very, very large project. So the delivery dates are you know, just a few years from now, three years from now. Well, we have a wide range of uh, sizes and prices and designs. Um, so, you know, something that you would typically see, you know, in a downtown market in terms of small to like 3,500 square feet. So quite a range. Um, That's quite a range then. Yeah, it is. So each building, we have three residential condominium buildings, and we've designed them so that they have different offerings with each building. So uh, the smallest building, which will be on Wellington Street, will actually have the largest homes. Averaging, you know, from 1,500, well, a range of 1,500 square feet to about 3,500 square feet. So, a little bit, something for everybody, almost. <laughs> right. oh, that's a positive note there. Yes. Something for everybody. Yes. Um, so, in the announcement, uh, two words, energy efficient and sustainability. Yes. Yes, we are. Um, every single Tridel condominium in the marketplace is designed to work with an energy standard called LEED, as, as will the uh, residences at the, at the well. Um, the mayor made reference to something even more unique in that all the heating and the cooling of, the resident, of this entire community, actually, uh, will be provided through OnWave. So this cistern that's being designed that will accommodate the heating and cooling is water that's coming from the lake. And so it's extremely energy efficient. You 
are watching Channel Y. Channel Y, a South Asian Canadian channel.